your website homepage is one of the most important pages on your website and can be used to highlight important items and draw visitors further into your website. One way to do so is to use a homepage carousel. This is Andrew from the Department of Internet Ministries. Let me show you how to use a homepage carousel to display multiple sliding images at the top of your homepage. Let's start with three best practices for working with your homepage carousel. Number one, have a clear call to action. Words like learn more, worship with us, ways to give, coupled with high quality, eye-popping visuals is your chance to entice someone into clicking that button. Number two, limit yourself. If you want your site visitors to see and engage with your slides, we suggest that you limit your carousel to three slides maximum. Number three, have a plan and a schedule. If you feel as though you need to add more, remember that you can rotate your featured items on a schedule, but you also have your information cards, announcement or news sections, and your website's menu to feature your content. Let's get started. After you have logged into the Evo CMS, edit your parish homepage and scroll down to the page carousel section. To add an image, click the insert button at the end of the image block and select one from your website's file manager or upload one from your local computer. It is important to remember these three rules when creating carousel images for your parish website. First, we suggest your carousel images be cropped to no greater than 1500 by 774 pixels and no less than 1200 by 630 pixels. But you may find that different dimensions work best for your site. Each slide should be optimized to be less than 150 kilobytes in file size. Second, Standards should be set high for the image quality, especially since your carousel is the first thing that your site visitors see when coming to your homepage. Use only the best looking images for your carousel to catch your visitors' attention and to best complement your website. Third, your photos or images should not have any words embedded in them since the Evo CMS allows you to easily overlay text on top of your slides. For this demonstration, I'm going to create a slide for Sunday School registration. If you want your slide to link to a page within your own website or to a website outside of your own, you must also include the following information. A descriptive caption title. One good sentence as caption text one or two words for a link title, a valid link to a page or document within your own website or to a website outside of your own. Finally, use this checkbox to decide whether the link will need to open in a new tab. A good rule of thumb is if the link is to a page on your own site, leave this unchecked. Let's look at how my new slide looks on my homepage. Here are a few extra things to take note of. Number one, to change the order of your slides, simply drag the slide that you would like to move up or down in the list and release it in place. Number two, to add or delete slides, click the green plus sign to add or the red dash button to delete. Both are in the top right corner of each slide. Remember, when you're done with your changes, be sure to click that green save button at the top of the page to commit your changes to your website. The homepage carousel is a great way to feature important content on your website. Don't forget to use high quality, clean images, have a simple, well thought out call to action, limit the number of items you have in your carousel, and have a plan to schedule for keeping your site fresh and on topic for your community's current needs. Thank you for following along. For additional support, visit support.goarch.org evolution, or you may send your questions to support at goarch.org.